Okay, now once you've, you've gotten into your Chromebook and you're using it, there are times when your teacher's going to want you to shut it down or to, to close it so that they can address you and get your attention. Of course, between classes, you're not going to walk around with this thing open. Um, you really do not need to sign out of your Chromebook. Um, since you're the only one who's going to be using it, you can stay signed in. You don't need to shut it down unless you're not going to be using it for a long time. So if you're going to be away for the weekend, then you might want to shut it all the way down. And to do that, you click right where you would click for the Wi-Fi. Um, and you will see down here a little power symbol that means shut down. Okay. Um, now, most of the time, you're not going to do that. If you're, it's at the end of class, the bell rings, the teacher releases you, all you have to do is close the lid. And then when you open the lid back up, it's automatically in standby, and then it will come back up and you'll see your picture and it'll ask for your password. So it automatically locks itself when you close the lid. Um, so most of the time I do not power down or log out of my Chromebook. I just close the lid, put it in my briefcase and away I go. Okay. So to get back in, all you have to do is type in your password you don't even have to type in that long email address again, and it will take me right back to where I was. So if I had my Gmail opened, even if I was composing a message, it would take me to that exact spot. So um, one of the many, many nice features of the Chromebook. Okay, so um, the keyboard for a Chromebook is slightly different from a regular laptop. You'll notice there are no function keys at the top. There's no F1, F2, things like that. Um, you'll also notice that there is no cap locks key. Um, there is a search key here um, that you can use to launch apps. You can program this key to be a caps, cap lock key, um, which is what I've done in mine. Um, there is also, um, let me open up a second window here, and we're going to zoom out. You can see the whole thing. Um, there is a key at the top. Um, well, actually, let's look at two keys. Um, one that looks like a square with two little triangles in the corners. It is the one, two, three, four, fifth key from the left. When you hit that, it will maximize your window. It'll fill up the screen. Hit it again, and it'll take it back to the way it was. Uh